Hello. Welcome to the stream. What's up, everyone? I am a little more streamlined <clears throat> this week. Oh. Uh, hey, boys. Jokes. So <laughs> hey, how are you doing, Mr. Heel? He was, like, ready to go. He was on it. Um, yeah, so we're going to play Fall Guys this week because I couldn't think of another game to play. And uh, It's perfect because it's the fall right now. I was waiting you like I know you're like a, you're a very passionate fan, and uh, we very much appreciate it. Don't uh, you have like a? Is no. this not your account that you used before? This is my account. I feel like you had a different outfit, like a better outfit. It wasn't just a default. Oh, this is my PS5 or my PlayStation account. That's what I. Yeah, different. So, I mean. Yes, it is different than the one we played on on stream last that's, time. That's what I meant. Yeah, but I have all of the old streaming equipment set up now, so we can hear the game this that's week. That's right. I can hear the music. Um, I didn't have to run over to my other computer to turn the stream on. <laughs> Look at you go. We can see it, the chat, very so easily. So prepared. I'm very prepared. Now I gotta I like get the prepared. Seinfeld music. <laughs> 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 We are playing on the PlayStation 5, the fifth. This music is so amped up, though. PlayStation. It is. Really gets you going. I'm amped. Tamped. I'm ready to use the entire power of the PS5. Look at you. You were, like, in the very front. Now nah, you've ruined it. I just gotta... I just gotta beat the... Games like this always frustrate me when it's like, we're all the same speed. Why is everyone faster than me? It's and I know perception. it's just all about like the I know like the angle of it or whatever, but it's like, why? I think this is new. I don't know if I've played this stage before. I've played it. This specific one. Yep. Oh my god. I didn't know you could do that. There we go. You just hold down the trigger, the oh. right trigger. Oh, good to know. It is good to know. How was your week, Mr. Heel? Yeah, how's it going? How's it going? It's a, to it's a Thursday. No, nose noise on the, the whole time. No response. Nothing. Oh, it's been good. Oh, no. Oh, oh, dear. My favorite part of that answer is how specific. Hey, tomorrow <laughs> off your weekend. Nice. Very nice. No. That's an oopsie doops. That's a, it's a very smart plan to take tomorrow off. I love taking tomorrow. Oh. oh my gosh. That, what was that? <laughs> you were like, that was, but, but it's fast. I'm way past it, but you know, I'm going to. And what else am I supposed to do at that yeah, point? You just got to wait, wait another cycle. You got this one. There you go. Oh, I might not make it though. You're good. You're going to make it. Oh, so maybe. Get that joker just waiting there. I start general, then go specifics, then I do a third thing. I'm waiting for the third thing. I've been waiting for the third thing for so long. I can't wait for the third thing. I have a very summery, springy drink here. <clears throat> Looks like a G&T. It's a G&T. Nice, bro. Ooh, yeah. 1% alcohol. <laughs> it's like 1%. <laughs> drink these all night. Boop, 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 boop. Do you see a new edition of a console there? It's not totally finished yet, but... PS2? The PS2. It's a little slim boy. It's a little one. Did you just get that? I've been working on it for a while. It's been broken. Mm. I've been restoring it. Very cool. So uh, we'll be able to play PS2 games. I could just bring mine over. You could, but but I have the like really the fat one. The, the fat one, or some games don't play in it. There are some advantages to the fat one and some disadvantages. And I had that like internet thing for the back of it. Oh yeah, but I don't think it actually like plugged in right. I mean, but you can put a hard drive in it and, like, load games off of it and stuff with that adapter. Yeah, but I'm not gonna. Uh, what are you gonna think about going hiking? I guess you don't have to tell us, but... Tell us! <laughs> tell us where you're hiking. Specifically, what time are you leaving and where are you leaving and from? And where? And are you gonna be alone? <laughs> How alone are you gonna be? And remember, if you can see them, they can see you. I am gonna be alone. Ooh, Perfect. La la. I mean, what are we talking. We talking state park. We talk. We talking uh, 
We talking nature preserve? We talking private, privately oh. owned? How, Land trust? What are we talking? How murdered do you want to be? State is Park. The real question here. You going to? Uh, and then this is going to localize us a little bit. You going to Turkey Run there? There, Mr. Heal. You going to Turkey Run? No. Going to Prophet's Town. Going to uh, not my Shades. Prophet. You going to Shades? False Prophet. Shades has some good trails. I am so not going to. Turkey Run it. has good trails too. Have you been to Shades specifically? Have you been to the Pine Hill? Uh, net, uh, no. Preserve. Shades on Tuesday. Oh, nice. So when you went to Shades, did you do the? I think it's called Pine Hill or, or Pine. Uh, Pine something. Pine Hill. Come on, this sucks. It's got all the backbones, like turkey backbone and devil's backbone. This is bad. It's like connected to Shades, like but it's not part of Shades. Ooh, my turn. It's your turn. I got very eliminated. So and where are you frustrated. headed? Where are you headed? Oh yeah, it's super cool. I've not been to the rest of Shades. I've just been to the. How do I? Okay, exit. <laughs> There you go. The Devil's Backbone in particular is super cool to walk across. Chain of lakes. Oh, uh, chain of lakes. How many lakes are we talking here? A whole chain of them. Dang. Not been. It's pretty far away. Check that out. Check that costume out. Heck yeah. All right. What are the controls? What's jump? Uh, X. And the trigger is the grab. Yeah. Which, and which then trigger? dive. It's the R two. That the back one. one. And then and dive is a uh, square. All right. All right. All right. All right. I offensive died, I died, I died. lakes? Are we talking chains or fences? That's here? offensive. A chain link fence of lakes. Recently went to Hawking Hills over spring break. That was pretty great. It was a Hawking good time. It's in Ohio, and it was a Hawking good time. I think I saw pictures on, on uh, social media. On the social meds? Yep. It looked like it had a lot of cool streams. And so lakes. many cool things to look at on those trails. I, for one thought it was pretty cool looking it was um i all the uh, we're talking about places we're going and i feel left out um because <laughs> <laughs> i haven't gone anywhere in forever uh one oh wait what are five things you saw on the trails you go five things i saw okay well just sort of a general thing general thing the one trail <laughs> it's uh the old man's cave trail it has so many like cool old stonework bridges and walls and stuff to look at. Doesn't sound very cool. Sounds pretty old. And then there's some really neat like architectural ones. Like there's this one bridge that was just these slabs of concrete that weren't really connected. So the the boys, my kids, really liked that because they had to like <laughs> jump from slab to slab. Old things are lame. <laughs> um, and then there's like the waterfalls are cool. You know, stuff like that. Stuff like that. That sounds like a pretty good insult. Some you caves. A lot of concrete. cool caves. Um, that was all Hawking Hills. Oh, so there's one one that's called a Rock House. And it's basically this old cave that used to be used for, like, Prohibition era. And Native Americans used it and stuff like that. So, like, really, they stored old booze there? Really, really cool. Yeah, I didn't see any booze, but... Oh, dang. You gotta keep looking for it. Secret booze. You know, I, I saw places where I imagined... Bo oh. oh! What? Yes! Did you see that? Yeah, I saw some cheats. You old disconnected slab of concrete. That's what I'm saying. I don't know. What's going on here? Sorry, I have to concentrate. Concentrate. Okay, I'll go then. Um, so, yeah... Two things. One, I haven't really gone anywhere because... What? You know, oh. oh, dang. You can go again. There were only like two people when I last time I looked. Yeah. We're going to do a mulligan roll, like a breakfast ball. Man. Like, uh, you always have to get past the first round. Yeah. <laughs> Might be my turn for a while, yeah. guys. <laughs> so, went to the gym for the first time in over a year. It's not a trail. It's not, but I'll get to the thing. Breakfast ball. Oh, yeah. So, in golf in the game of golf sometimes when you play in the morning because it's your first time right. off the tee and you're like very like you're not loose yet you're not doing anything you have to like the first one off the tee actually has to go somewhere but so were you playing golf no i i just mentioned breakfast ball what's breakfast ball because i was talking about mulligan because you didn't make it past the first round oh and that's a golf thing yeah breakfast ball or bowling do they have that in bowling mulligans breakfast. oh mul yeah yeah 
What's a breakfast ball? That's what I was just explaining. When you're on the when you're oh. uh, your uh, first shot off the tee in the morning. I thought it, you were talking about it's not good. You because you were like I went to the gym and then I went, had a breakfast ball. No, I so I went to the gym and then you didn't win. And so I said, Mulligan, breakfast ball. You have to get past the first round. Oh, okay. Nothing to do with the gym. Uh, disconnected. I'm so confused. <laughs> what about breakfast ball at Tiffany's? Yes. Fried green tomatoes. Um, I think I remember the film. And as I recall, I think we both kind of liked it. Both kind of liked it. Yeah. Well, that's wait one a, thing we wait got. Wait a minute. They don't have breakfast at Tiffany's. That's a jewelry store. Oh, Tiffany's? Yeah. I've never actually seen the movie. Is it about the jewelry store, Tiffany's? It's about the... Oh, good. It's the same one. There's a song. Bre- Breakfast Time and Ring. Oh, my God. We're so far off track. We're just, asso- like, free associating. Yeah, I was saying the lyrics to that song, and no I one know. noticed. I did. No one, no one even noticed. Why do you think I said they don't even serve breakfast at Tiffany's? That's not part of the song. No, that's an observation about Tiffany's. It's not, it's not the lyrics. Oh, my God. And I said, what about breakfast? They don't serve breakfast at <laughs> Tiffany's. <laughs> She said, I think uh, that's a jewelry store. We should probably go to the diner down the street. (laughs) Uh, I'm not hungry, so I'm kind of hungry, so let's eat. I'm just a little peckish. I'll probably get the oatmeal. (laughs) Hungry, so let's eat. (laughs) Wow. Oh, it disconnected. Mulligan. (laughs) Yeah, a little bit. I hate when this happens. All right, so there's some technical difficulties happening. This has been happening, and I am very frustrated with it. This is why Ethan's here. here This is why he's here. I mean, these aren't audio issues, but they are issues. Oh! Alright, we're back. Oh, no. Alright. I gotta figure that out. I I think I figured out one thing, but another thing didn't take. Well, you know what? I think I'm gonna make it. Yeah. No one's qualified yet, but they're all about to. A breakfast ball is when you're playing golf and you just blip out of existence. (laughs) Yeah. You're actually doing okay! (laughs) No, this is what happened last time. I was okay, and then all of a sudden I wasn't. This is not your fault. This is the uh, connection's fault. Like, everyone's about to go in all at once. Why can't I get up this? Oh, yeah, you're not going to make it. Um, okay, went to the gym. Back on track. So I went to the gym for the first time in a year because I'm fully vaccinated now, so I feel okay doing that. Um, one, I'm extremely sore. Two, very... Uh, I-, I was surprised at the... Corex policies like they they really like divided everything out and made it um so like people aren't completely breathing on each other that's cool yeah um so like in the racquetball courts they have a wall <laughs> between yeah. the play oh uh, don't even give me start i want to play racquetball so i do too so, so bad. i think bad. about it probably at least yeah like once a week or oh so. oh my god i would i would love nothing more for the last racquetball. four years i've been like oh man i should play record- i should play racquetball We've tried, but then every time I get a text, it's like, nah, I can't make it this morning. I feel like we have, that hasn't happened in a long time. Well, because I stopped trying. No. Yeah. I There weren't that many times where I said I couldn't do it. There's at least three. Well, listen, when it's like Friday night and there's been revelry, sometimes you're like, you, you, you write checks that your bank account can't cash. <laughs> which well, is like, yeah, let's get up at seven and play racquetball. Pretty much any time. I'm ready to play racquetball. You say that. I do, right but now. But then I'm going to be like, hey, let's play. And you'll be like, oh, I have like a political meeting. I'm I mean, doing, that's, a, that's I'm doing a webcast. It's possible those things are happening. But it's good to check because I want to play so bad. Yeah. Um. But you have to make reservations now. So you Well, the, the Y, you know, might have courts too. Yes, that is true. So Jim's good. I'm I'm uh, probably gonna go back this weekend. Uh, I'm not gonna go back tomorrow because uh, too sore. Got to heal up. Got to heal up. I for real. Don't skip heal day. I you really shouldn't skip heal day. Tyrant heal day. I I can't stress that enough. No. And in other news about traveling, this is why I was on this. Um, a bunch of the marathons decided that they're gonna try it for this year. Good. Uh, see, Achilles didn't look what happened to him. Yeah, that dang heel. Uh, so I tyrannical uh, heel. In fact. I got into New York last Come year on. and they canceled it. And they did this thing where like you could have that pushed it ridiculous. forward. No, 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 no. And so they let me put no, no, preference no, 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 no. now. So they're gonna try to hold it. And I don't know if I'll be able to run it this year. But I signed up for Minneapolis, which opened up just recently, and Wisconsin. So I'm at least doing two, barring any 
unforeseen circumstances. What? Very extremely what exciting. What is this like jello pudding that's coming down at me? You're what gonna is this? <laughs> you're gonna try this here. I mean, how can I even walk up that? Oh, I don't even know. I was so close. I'm so sorry. I was so close. Do you to want it. to do it again? Do you yes. want to try it? Yes. One okay. more. Okay, that's fine. No, you do it. So that's my my marathon journey. I'm I'm super stoked about it. I've already put in more miles this year than I think I've had any year. So brunch ball. Brunch ball. I'll tell you this. Brunch brawl. One of the best things to do after an early morning marathon is like a really good boozy brunch. Five things I saw in the marathon. Uh, usually I see. A really old person who's run like a gajillion marathons and they're wearing some shirt this is like this is my whatever it's marathon 80th 70th and mm -hmm. they are like at an L shape and like staring at the ground just kind of yep. like hunching and, and just going for it um, something about bowel movements all the time somebody's holding a sign that's like it's okay to just poop or I just <laughs> farted like all the time and I'm like I don't need to see these signs uh, Something about somebody's booty. Those are common signs. Something about uh, a sign like, oh, if you thought this was hard, I had to make this sign. Yeah. There's always a costume. Oh, always costumes. Always costumes. Um, and then like halfway, I mean, I'm speaking not from marathon experience, but just other races. Halfway through, there's always like a discarded costume. <laughs> like, oh, yeah. It gets somebody was hard. like, oh, okay, this was a mistake. Gotta ditch this. Like the, that, the Santa hustle, like after the first couple miles, just a pile of Santa beards. Oh, absolutely. Like, because it's like, they're the cheapest Santa beards that you can possibly ever have. After too. the first selfie opportunity yep. to dump it. Because then they're like just sweating and they look haggard. And like those little uh, cups of M&Ms were a mistake. All the, I was just about to mention that. There's always usually like... <laughs> the uh, gimmick. People like lining up, but they'll bring their own food. So there's like official stations for like gels or gummies or mm -hmm. like water, Gatorade. Um... Those are all great, like good things. Uh, one, be careful about how much water you intake. That's just tips from me. Um, you wanna sparse that out or space it out. Make sure you're getting enough, but not too much because that you have to carry that with you. No, um, no, 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 no. Another thing is yes. uh, people doing that, they'll hand out like, hey, we're having a party over here. They'll be blaring music or they'll be like, like have a band, they'll be playing guitar. Like I'm all for that. That's like what makes the marathon experience so great is everyone's so stoked about it. But then they'll be like, have a beard. I'm like, dude, I got like 16 more miles. Do you think I want that in me right now? Afterwards. And then you're like, I, I do want it. Give I, it. Oh, desperately, I do want it, but just not in that moment. But some people will take them up on it. I'm like, mistake. That's a mistake for you. That's an oopsie. Come on, One of the come best on, things come on, come that, on, that, that on, marathon no! people never provide that you should add. Anybody who does this is a saint in my book. That wasn't my fault. Orange slices. Oh my god, orange slices. They're the best things. They could clear your mouth out. They give you like an energy boost. They're amazing. You know, uh... Oh, I forgot to grab. A fun fact. Oranges are nature's oranges. Oh my god. That is amazing. Someone... I don't know if you've seen that tweet that's like... Someone said like, uh... Fun fact, blueberries are the only things that uh, a color was named after yeah. a fruit. And then someone said, what about star fruit? And they're mm -hmm. like, <laughs> close, that's <laughs> close, a shape. Close, that's a shape. <laughs> I don't have any self-control to train for a marathon, let alone say no to a single beer at any point. I tell you, the beer at the end is very, very good. Yeah, a little recovery beer. I, absolutely. Um, a bunch of marathons now provide some sort of beer at the end, and it is so good usually they'll have a local brewery there and that is just one they always have milk i i say no to milk some people think it's great the I, chocolate milk that was like oh so good it's too it's after, too much not to be fair i haven't run a half marathon and like to be fair well since we last ran a half marathon together yeah but the chocolate milk was always the best thing at the end my stomach just it doesn't do dairy that well as it is and let alone uh just like I just feel terrible after yeah. I have that. So water and beer and a Sprite banana. Sprite and a banana, and then you jump up and down a whole bunch. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, Mentos and uh, Diet Mentos Coke. Mentos and Diet Coke. <laughs> but you got to eat the Mentos first and then drink the oh, yeah, Diet Coke yeah. on top. And just, like, foam up the mouth. <laughs> <laughs> uh, run high, running cross-country in high school, people would always just puke as they ran. That's wild to me. I've never had the urge to puke while running same because i never ran as fast as i possibly could the entire time um 
I know people say that they do that or they shit themselves. Um, I did have a friend who would frequently have to go off the like anytime there was a wooded area on a race, he would like jump into the woods and poop <laughs> during the race. It's like, how, man? How are you doing this? He would always do better than me too. He would always be what? faster. I've never seen this before. This is wild. What? Am I supposed to swim? How do I, I guess so. Oh, you can just, oh, just the physics jump. are different. Yeah. Wild. Um, whoa. I can't see what's I can't see what's in front of me. You can move the camera. What? Oh. Uh, Oh, I see. Oh. They're jumping up to these. It's Oh, it's space physics. That's what it this is. This is hard. That's hard. But yeah, and the music I, uh, slows down too. My, like, my whole system when I start running, like, clenches up. Like, oftentimes I'll have to, like, pee, but, like, most of the time I don't have to do anything. It's just everything just, like, cinches. Um, afterwards, it's like a horror show, but, like, before that. Yeah. And uh, I exclusively had an urge to peak while running. Well. There's an oops. No, when I used to run that five mile uh, route we used to do, um, I'd get about the three mile mark back there on Earl, mm -hmm. and I would always have to poop so bad. <laughs> and I would, like, there were times when I was seriously considering, like, I'm like, I'm gonna have to knock on this stranger's door. I'm gonna have to knock on their door. You have to go that way. I know, but I, I, <laughs> those were gonna open up. Ah, uh, see? There. You have to knock on someone. Hey, can I? Can I please? I was gonna like. I, I'm sorry, but I I need to. Oh my god! Someone. This is stupid. Interesting. I'm like in awe of this new stage that I haven't seen before. Uh, oh, they have pinball flippers. There's so much. What is this? I'm. Oh my god. I can't even stand on it. I don't understand. Oh, you <sighs> yeah. Nah. I don't even. I don't even know how I was supposed to do that. Eliminated. Crazy. Oh well. Gave it the old college try. You gave it the old college four tries. I did. But to be fair. To be fair. To be fair. Ooh. Ooh. Pretty good. Getting that alien costume. Yeah. I've been pretty sore this week because I've been working on building a fence. How's that going? Pretty good. You have to tear down the old one? I do. Which isn't too bad because the people who put it in... Uh, didn't put it very far in the ground and didn't use concrete for a lot of it. So, <laughs> was it offensive lakes? A what? Was it offensive lakes? Offensive lakes. Uh, actually, yes. Which is another hard thing. All the water. Oh yeah. Uh, but there's two like heights. There's a there's like a small picket fence and then there's a bigger privacy fence. So the pickets were in concrete, but not very much. Like, like there might as well not have been any. So like the posts come out of the ground three feet, but they only went in the ground one foot. And there was like six inches of concrete, like the size of a coffee can. Of con enough. No, not enough. So, like, I basically just can lift them out. Yeah. My without any tools, I just I, pulled them out of the I ground. I remember the the gate door was like basically not on. It was. Like, oh, that yeah, that that side's bad too. Like rotted out. So I and the fence is really rotten anyway. So like tearing it down is easy. But then I had to dig the holes two feet deeper. Like every hole, I had to dig it. Yeah. Down to three feet. Did you so. get an auger or whatever? No, because I um. I just have to use postal diggers because I'm just doing a little bit here and there as I can. And so renting an auger, I'd have to use it all at once. So I have to tear the whole fence down and do all the holes. Yeah. So it's like I just have to do a little bit at a time. So that part really sucks, digging oh, the holes on. deeper. Because there's always like roots and things that I have to cut out. But uh, I did one section last weekend of the picket, the shorter picket fence that was probably... Unbelievable. I don't know, 25 feet. So it was like five posts, including a gate. And then today I just did a short section on the privacy fence part, which those posts, they're like, <laughs> nickname I call it, six <laughs> inches of concrete. Those posts are like six feet tall, but they're only in the ground like a foot and a half as well. 
and there's no concrete. Like, I just lifted them out of the ground. Myself. Like, I wiggled it twice and just lifted it out. So, whoever put the fence in did a really bad job. I had to dig the holes back down to three feet, put some concrete around the post. It was just, like, such a pain. But I bought a nail gun and an air compressor, so that part is super great putting the pickets up, because it's just like, ka-chunk, 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 ka-chunk. You have to ka-chunk it. You gotta ka oh, oh, wait. Oh, yeah, down there. Yeah. Uh, anyone watching, if you don't have a nail gun, get one, because it's just fun. I mean, it's so much easier, especially if you're, like, having to do a repetitive nail task. Yeah. And even if you don't, it's just fun to use. Just shoot at your friends. Yeah. Most of them have a safety feature in the front where you have to be against, like, a, a flat surface. Oh, just go back and forth. That's... Go across. That's the way to do it. Come on! But, uh, you can totally get around that by pushing that little sensor down and then... Come on! ...shooting it anyway, and it, they go real far. The nails. I am I don't know, getting extremely frustrated by the flippers. You got the strat though. Ah! Oh. Oh. Gotta get that timing down. All these levels, just like it's just you gotta have done them a few times. You the, bastard! To get the <laughs> you prick! To get the timing down. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, oh so close. that was the one! That was gonna be it. That was the one! That was gonna be it. Alright, well, here's my breakfast ball. Guns are fun. That's Guns cute. are fun. Augur, I hardly know her. I do really enjoy shooting guns, but I don't really want to own a gun. Um, it has been an extremely long time since I shot a gun. Oh, yeah. Like, I want to say high school. Yeah. It was, like, scouts and In stuff. In Boy Scouts, yeah. yeah. Black powder rifles and shotguns and stuff like that. I should ask my dad to take me to a shooting range. He'd probably really enjoy that. There's one right over here. <laughs> well, I mean, he, like, belongs to a shooting range mm -hmm. and, like... Has a few, has a couple pistols, because he thinks that's his duty as a Republican. <laughs> well, you know what? You know how you fight bad guys with guns? Good guys with awkwardly guns. and shoot yourself in the foot. Yeah. Uh, actually, that's not who the guns are for. They're for the government. Oh yes. That's they don't. The AR, that's what the AR-15 is for, right? The government. It's not like the government has drones that can shoot I was you from say, the, the stratosphere. The thing about the government is they kind of have a monopoly of the guns. They have like all of them. They have like a lot of guns. Yeah, it's just such a dumb argument. This is for when the government comes calling. Like, who do you think is coming? Also, who's the biggest bootlickers in the fucking world? Oh, yeah, for sure. You're going to stand up against... Give, give me a break. Like, <laughs> yeah. When, they, when the government was a problem, they didn't do anything until the government was about to not be a problem yeah. anymore. Like I said, they like... You know, French kiss the fucking police. Are you kidding me? But I think what they're imagining in their head is like some CIA agent in like a suit and tie and a briefcase knocking on their door saying like, hey, you got to come with you us. You got to come with us. And they're like, over my dead body. Yeah, if you want my guns, you're going to have to take them. And they're like, okay, okay we will, we we'll will take the guns. Firebomb your house. We will take the guns. I did not anticipate this part of the story. <laughs> like I mean history is full of stories about dudes who tried to fight the government in bulldozers covered in steel and concretes and they were actually kind of successful until they died you the problem with the the like individual and the guns thing is like you could fight the government for a while for a little bit but like ultimately it's always going to be if you have a mass movement and at that point like the guns thing is a little get off of me <laughs> <laughs> like every every standoff with the government ends in that person dying or getting arrested if they're white yeah but the well, thing is, no, the thing is, people who are in standoffs with the government are pretty much exclusively white males. Uh, yeah. 
uh, look what they did to Fred Hampton, and he wasn't even doing it to stand off with the government. Exactly. They came in with a lot of guns and killed him. Uh, yeah, it's just a bad plan. You need a mass movement of people, and you need people to do that. And kind of by a lot of the logic is when you are like right wing is to exclude people. Doesn't mean it's not successful. The Nazis were a thing. And still are. Oh, yeah, yeah. But I mean, like, they were, you know, a major political party. Oh, were you trying to talk about your job, Mr. <laughs> Heal? Interviews for two new advisors? I just did a bunch of interviews for student workers this past week, so I feel you... Improv Club at School just had our first in-person meeting in, like, a semester. That's cool. Did you guys just wing it? <laughs> I did. <laughs> I like, yeah, normally I, I mean, in the spring semester, I would at least have what exercises and games I wanted to do with them, but this time I was just like, all right, guys, what do you want to do? Because <laughs> it was the first day back, and I thought, like, we'll just see who shows up and see who, what they want to do. Went pretty well. But I'll tell you what, i tell you what. What do you tell me? Oh, it's rough. With their students, some of these, some of these high schoolers, man, <laughs> Dude, they're they're versions of comedy. Oh man, look at they're this! They're just they're just real green. Oh, for sure, real green. But some of them, like, some of them, I am surprised, pleasantly surprised, how often they show up, despite oh. the fact that they are really struggling and they just keep coming. I mean, that's how you learn. Yeah, there's no other way. People are very rarely just amazing at improv they might be funny they might have comedic instincts right but them being just uh like immediately good at improv very rare because mm -hmm. you got it's always about partners and support oh yeah that's what i wanted that was to lucky do. i was lucky no that was unlucky that no was unlucky don't jump on that one again i don't stop want it. to stop it stop Haha, <laughs> that was lucky. Gated. <laughs> Improv has practices. Used to. Man. Ethan, are you gonna be in the uh, the online show? I can't do the online shows. Cause kids. Yeah, they're right at bedtime, and where I would do it is right next to. Where do I? Am I doing sleeping. this even correctly? I feel like I'm going in a circle. You are going in a circle. But like, is there an endpoint that I'm looking for? Oh, uh. That's a great question. I don't know. It really does seem like you've been here before. It does, right? Maybe go... Yeah, I, I think I was just going in a circle. Yeah, there was something that you missed. Somewhere. I am awesome. Oh, it I'm said excited. run two laps. Oh, did it? Okay. I, yeah. I was getting close then. Yeah. This is I am. We're going to be cool. using the same computer for streaming that we're using for to map play yeah, that's it right. Good, that's a cool scheme. No. I might try to tune in and watch a little bit, but yeah. like I said, it's right right at bedtime. Oh man, that GNT was good. Which was the best part, the G or the T? Um, actually, I think the G might have made it. The G might have made it. Run across the rotating ring, so I'm gonna. Ooh, this is a new one too. I'm gonna be bad at this. The cool thing about uh, not playing this game very much is that they're all new to me. This is new to me. This music gets me pumped up, though. Pump it up. Pump up the jams. Pump it up. Pump you up. I've been playing... I don't know if you were an, a Mortal Kombat fan. Did you play a lot of Mortal Kombat? Um, I played a little bit of Mortal Kombat, but as you know, that was pretty mainstream. 
<laughs> that's true. That is true. You were playing and, uh, Eternal Champions. That's I was. I played what I could get. That's the thing. So nah, oh. you played what was at Menards. I played well, yeah, <laughs> Menards. What I could get um, cheap used at GameStop. The only new game I ever bought was Sonic and Knuckles, and I paid for it with pennies. Well, that it's that lock on technology. It really got everybody. Although it didn't get me because I didn't have a Sega Woo! Genesis until I was an adult. A what system? A Sega Genesis. Oh yeah. We only ha ever had a Genesis, then a PS2, because we had family members who bought them and didn't want them anymore. Yeah, it makes sense. And now I have a Sega Genesis right there with a 32X ballooning oh, out the top. I didn't realize what this was going. Sorry, I'm talking about the no, game. No, it's, it's fine. It's fine. Yeah, it looks like you're going to make it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. But, uh, yeah, I've been playing the original three Mortal Kombats. Nice. Um, I, it's, they're so different than Street Fighter. Like, I'm, I'm just kind of learning them. I played some Soul Calibur. I love Soul Calibur. Great game. I have a Dreamcast right there. That's not what I played it on. What'd you play it on? I don't know. That was the only thing it came out for. I mean, it, like, there, except there were, for the sequels. There were others. There were sequels, yeah. I think it's Soul Calibur 2. PlayStation 1, maybe? PlayStation 2. PlayStation 2, that's yeah. what I played it on. It had the PlayStation. That was the one where they um, all the different versions had a different character. I like the nightmare guy with the weird yeah, sword. Yeah, big sword. Yeah. So the PlayStation Two version had Hihachi from Tekken, and the GameCube version had Link from nice. the Zelda series, and the Xbox version had Spawn. You mean Zelda? Yeah, I mean Zelda. <laughs> the game's not called Link. Uh, the second one is. Well. The Adventures of Link. <laughs> the adventures. <laughs> that sounds made up. Oh boy. Oh me, oh my. But yeah, that was cool. I love Soul Calibur is a really fun game. They just uh they're on the sixth one now. There's a big tournament last week. I watched it. It was good. Nice. I also played the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles fighting game. Oh yeah, Tournament Fighters. Yeah. That was a good great. game. Great game. Um and other competition news uh we had opening day this past week and i don't know if anybody else is baseball fans but i've been enjoying the crap out of it have you i am anxious to get to go to a, a jeff game yeah at the new stadium we yeah they're in practicing now i run by there and they're they've had some games there yeah it looks nice it does look nice i hate that light they put in don't know on main to get to the stadium oh, i don't mind it <laughs> You don't have to take it every day. True. Uh, but it's, yeah. I'm a fan of the All-Star game not being in light. Yeah, totally. Um, that law desperately needs to change. I don't think it's going to change. What they do need to do is the Dems need to stop fucking around, get rid of the filibuster, and pass HR1. Yeah, for real. Like, yesterday. Like, or they will be locked out of power, and I don't time, mean that lightly. I don't, it, I don't understand why they're not just getting rid of it. The time for that kind of diplomacy BS... Like, it was a long time ago. It was a long time ago. And it's it, it even goes against what the filibuster was originally intended it's for. It's crazy that they're still, like, trying to play nice when it's clear that the other Insanity. side is not interested. It got abused during civil rights. It's going to keep getting abused for civil rights still. It is not even... Like, th there's no contest here. It's either you do it or you don't get reelected. That's just the I know. The I don't understand it. what their problem is. Uh... I don't know. Ask all the people who don't want to do it. It sounds like there, there's a good possibility that they are going to nuke it in some fashion. Um, be it make it a talking one, which effectively eliminates it anyway. Um, because nobody's going to stand up there and read Dr. Seuss for eight hours. Because nobody wants to do that. That's the thing. Nobody wants to actually be there. Right. So, uh, what? You do it for Ew, 48 mean, hours? Uh, legislate? Yeah. Gross. That's the thing, yeah. Another fun baseball thing <laughs> is that... <laughs> is that text tech was vaccinating folks during their baseball b game because texas said fuck everybody text tech you mean like texas, texas tech? tech um that's oh awesome if they were oh my god why can't i jump on that that's fantastic news i'm very glad to see a lot of people are getting their vaccines i know a lot of people recently who got their their first shot oh you're gonna do it yeah <laughs> Yes. That's impressive. Pretty close. Pretty close. Yeah, I actually knew two separate people I saw during the first, uh, during that day where um, they, they came from there with their first uh, jab. 
Local college. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, what are you doing? <laughs> like, you could have just said Purdue. You mentioned Texas Tech. You could have just said Purdue. And then no one had to know it was local. God, yeah, you're so really... You said it was local. You are really doing a good job of local putting college. a big target on our back. You know how many people would piss off on this stream? You know how many people live near Purdue? Like, they're going to be able to narrow us down. Yeah. Like, use yeah. R2 to grab eggs. Oh, the next... Okay, R2 eggs. I can do this. I can grab eggs. I can grab eggs all day. It's freaking Easter. I'll what? watch kids get falling off bikes all day. I don't give a fuck about your kids. kids. <laughs> I'm gonna get murdered in the woods lakes tomorrow, so I don't give a fuck anyway. Everyone's yeah. gonna think that you did that, but really it'll just be in the electric. Here's room. the thing, if you do, it really makes us look very guilty. So just try to stay alive is all I'm saying. Uh, give me the egg. I want the egg. You got it! I got the egg. Where's the nest? Okay. All Crushed right. it. How do I get out of the you nest? You have to there you go. You can all use use the R to like climb up and, and things. Hey, those are our eggs. Those are my eggs. Give Someone me that, Give me the egg back. No. <laughs> no. No. You no. can take eggs from their nest too. These are my eggs now. What you can do about it, bit? <laughs> oh, we are losing like by a lot handily um ethan i want you to know by Give me that egg. watching this stream you have uh tacitly no, agreed to uh any sort of rights and your family and your next of kin uh for prosecuting tim and matt play and those we represent you go you are so gonna lose <laughs> listen everyone's gonna think that you were murdered in the woods but you'll just be in the electrical room oh god that took a little bit of time I don't know if uh, Mr. Heel was around for uh, that. That was rough. <laughs> Look, it's not about. Give me the uh, egg. Yeah, there was a there was a student that died at a local college. At local college. Back in the mid two thousands. And everyone was looking all over the place. Yeah, the I woods. Was, I was a freshman during that time. I was a freshman. Was I? No, you were a sophomore. Sof a sophomore. Yeah, you're one year older than I am. Get, st why did you grab me? You're on my team. What is that guy doing? We Boy, you guys got smoked. I feel like <laughs> most of our team members weren't playing the game. Smoked. They weren't even... One of them grabbed me. <laughs> That was not my fault. That was my team's fault. I'd do better if it wasn't for my stupid team. It was a stupid team. Got some kudos. Ooh. Ooh shark got some bot. shark bot. Let's equip these bad boys. Nice. Who needs to match? Not me. Not us. I'm glad I thought ahead. I saw the future and had this streaming setup 4K capable so the new consoles just plug and play so I don't have to buy a whole bunch of new stuff. There you go. I was just visionary. You know, eventually you're going to have to buy a bunch of new stuff because that's just Always. who you are. Well, and that's just how it goes. It's how, so it goes. Like, this is an 8K capable, and if 8K comes along when it eventually does, or 12K, I'm not ready for that. Listen, how many Ks do we need, really? We kind of don't need more than four, in my opinion. Four is pretty high def. But that doesn't mean it's going to stop. Can't stop, won't stop. You know, you can't stop the bum rush. I tried, and they wouldn't let me. <laughs> <laughs> you can't steal my sunshine. Is that a song? Like... Breakfast at Tiffany's. It is a song by Ellie N. Is that who it's by? I don't know. You know the song. I do know the song. Yeah. You can't bring me down, Bruce. Yes, Ellie N. Bruce. Yeah, I didn't know. Ellie N. There it is. Yeah. But I did know. The, I do know the song. It's a great song. Steal my sunshine. Bum -ba -da -bum -ba -da -bum -ba -da -bum. I have that album. 
But, Do you have uh, it on cassette? The cassette? I had a, a, C, a, a CD, a compact disc. But I'll tell you what, most of it's not good. <laughs> you know what is a good album? Something. Tub by, Thumping. Tub Thumping is a good album. By Chumbawamba. It's Chub a great Awamba. album. So many good songs in the album, and only one gets radio play, and it's tragic. I mean, it doesn't still get radio play, but it. It did. It did. Like a lot. Like a lot. Yeah. And there are so many other. Like Good Ship Lifestyle. Such a good song. Such a good song. It's like a. Uh, what am I thinking? Small Town. Great song. Ow. I, I can't <laughs> think right now. Yeah, that album was, was not dummy thick. We're going to go for it. We're going to YOLO. You can do it. No, yeah. you didn't do it, man. And you did. Oh, that. oh, I almost. You just got. Almost lucked out. You got yeeted. You're not going to try it again? No, I'm not. I'm going to take the safe route. Are you sure it's safe? Because the last time safer. you were on this route. Safer. Safer. I will take that. I will accept. So, uh, the company that made this game, um... Oh, oh me. so safe. The company that made this game, Mediatonic, um, got bought by, uh... Got bought! You got bought! Epic. Oh, nice. So, people make Fortnite now on this game. Yeah, that makes sense. <clears throat> hey, Mr. Malk. What up? What up, Big Shoots? <laughs> hey, Big Shoots. Big Shooter. And you can count on me waiting for you in the parking lot. This is Fall Guys. Autumn Dudes. Autumn Dudes. All damn dudes. You're a dude. He's I'm a, a dude. dude. She's, She's a dude. dude. Cause we're all dudes. Hey! Ooh, this is the one you didn't get last time. Oh, yeah. Two laps around. Ladders, ladders, ladders. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Big shoots. Did you watch that most recent season? I am about halfway through it. It, it was fine. Um, yeah, about halfway. I the first episode really like was not a strong start for me. The thing about a show like Letter Kenny is that you're always trying to watch it for the first time. Oh, for sure. And, like, it, it's not going to happen. Yeah. Like, you're always going to be chasing that high oh, of experiencing absolutely. it for the first time. I was, um... Oh, welcome to the party, though. What up, what up, what up? Um, yeah. When I first watched that show, you were the one who was just like, you got to watch this show. Oh, my God. If you're not watching the show, you're not living. Well, it was true. Um, and, I, and it really took about two seasons for it to click with me. And then it really clicked with me. Yeah, like the first episode, you're like, "What is this?" Yeah. Like, what is what is this? And then you're like, "Oh yeah, for the boys, boys." For the boys, boys. And then, and, and then, then you never stop saying it. And then it's like, like it's so quotable. It's so quotable. But then you're like, "I've seen this before." The thing that they, I think they do a decent job of is they do reuse gags a lot, but they don't let them all overstay their welcome. They they yes. Do, no, and like that's what the show is. So it's like you know, you know what it is. Like the, the, you know, like you got a problem with Canada geese, you got a problem with me. Like that was only one episode, Such but they said fun. it a lot. So funny, but it was like really good. <clears throat> so they kind of do that a lot. They'll they'll use a gag and then they'll let it die. And there's some mainstays that stick around. Must be nice. Must be fucking nice. <clears throat> yeah. So like I enjoyed the season. I thought it was fine. But, I don't know. It, like, lo the show has lost a little of its magic. For me. Well, it got popular. I, that's not it. I, it's just, like, I, that's the kind of show, like, you, when you've seen it, you've seen it. And it's going to be the same. I, I, I have it's some... Great, but what it's the like, hell do I do now, though? <laughs> How can I get through this? You gotta... You just gotta do it, man. H you How? Jump, you gotta jump. You gotta jump. There you go. What? Oh. I'm fucking stuck. There, there we go. go. <clears throat> that was rough. That was rough. All right, you, you recovered. <coughs> Not gonna make it though. I don't think I'm gonna make it. Get away from me. No. Rip. That sucks. Might be all about time. Tim's a fucking hipster. Yeah, this will be the last. Why am last I a hipster? 
because it, it got popular and I was like, oh, no thanks. Man. No, no, I, uh... No, I really enjoyed it. I, I, some of the seasons were great. Like, the one season that where they had the, the PBS show, like, the... <laughs> that was so great, because that was just, uh, like... Crack an egg and, uh, bet you can't. <laughs> no, bet you can't. Crack an egg. <laughs> it was so good. Uh, and the whole season was kind of about that, and I really enjoyed that that gimmick. He was like, crack, what can crack, crack an egg? Bet you know, can't. <laughs> so... The agricultural hall is for agriculture. And they've really kept some stuff music. alive. Like, I like the most recent season where they're like, if you can't carry a bag, maybe you, sh- you shouldn't be playing hockey. Yeah, like, yeah. Like, they're making all those kids carry their bags. Like, oh. I think that they, they did a good job of, for the most part, of, um, like, the show is about the main group of people, but they flesh out pretty much everybody else. Yeah. They're given enough screen time, and they do a little bit of character development. Except, agree, agree. Except for one sole character. And that character is um gale gale don't like gale gale is a one note one dimensional one character. note and it's not funny like i'm sick of it i'm sick uh, of it i, I really wish out. they would have done something to like you know what they did with the rest of them just make it a little they tried because she like slammed jim dickens yeah but that wasn't funny Dickskin? yeah dickskin jim dickskin it wasn't funny uh i don't think gale's funny i don't i think it's gross gale's a little gross um Whoa. What the heck even happened? We lost is what happened. Why did I have this? Because I lost. Oh, wait. I wasn't... I wasn't playing. Oh. That's why... <laughs> that's why it seemed weird. I was like, the controls are so weird, I can't even jump. <laughs> I couldn't figure out who I was. It's because I was just observing, that's why. Because we were too en- engrossed in the, the conversation. I was so confused. <laughs> How's everybody? How's everybody doing tonight? How's this? Uh, how's your? How's your reviews of Letter Kenny? <laughs> Crockett, that doesn't look cool. Nah, not with you have a robot, so right? With an alien under it. That's right. Do, do, do. But yeah, that's all to say. To bring it fully all the way around, I'm really glad that baseball's back, and I've been watching a lot. Baseball's of it, back, and all I right. like it. Children are a cesspool <laughs> illness and misfortune. Mother's poop. <laughs> yeah. They totally are. I figured out a way to... So my parents have Comcast. Uh, Comcast, if you're listening, you're legally not allowed not to. Um, <laughs> not enough audio issues. Yeah, I hear ya. I, I created a VPN at my parents' house so I can stream all their channels from anywhere. Like here. Oh, nice. You used to be able to like, you, like lock, lock out. Um, but I figured out a way around it. So thanks. The problem was I actually tried to sign up for MLB and they're like blackout in your area. So I couldn't watch any of the uh, things to buy. And I was like, well, I'm not going to do anything. Yep. Yeah, exactly. I hereby declare that you cannot use my photos. How did you get this address? How did you get this number? <laughs> I get those. If you don't repost this, Facebook's going to do this. And like, <laughs> that's not true. That's not how it works. Or the, the in back in the day, the old wear sites, they're like, if you are a law enforcement officer, by clicking enter, you are no longer allowed. Like, you are not yeah. allowed to. It's like, yeah, this is none of this. If is, you're uh, a cop. Legally binding. Cop. I do not grant Facebook permission to use my information. That's so funny. <laughs> repost. Just the people I see post that, I'm like, oh, no. Or the people who don't understand at all how it works. They're like, you're just supposed to like, oh, yeah, I'm a little hungry. And they're like, I'm hungry, too. And it's just like, <laughs> how did you, why are you posting this on my wall? And I'm like, I'm not. This is just the feed. Yeah, this is just the feed. My grandma thought that everything she saw was sent to her. <laughs> yeah, exactly. She's not alone. There's a lot of people. And then she's like, how that. did you get into my email? It's <laughs> like, no, no. Oh, you no sweet. One- you sweet summer child. <laughs> no, <laughs> you sweet summer child. Oh, my sweet summer child. Yeah, you know, I got the vaccine and suddenly my cell reception was really good. <laughs> Mine wasn't. <laughs> you didn't get the good one. Which one did you get? It depends <laughs> on which version of 5G you get. There's just this constant ringing voice in my ear. <laughs> and it keeps just saying numbers. All I hear is someone narrating the things I'm doing all day. <laughs> I just hear my own voice over and over. It's so annoying. Oh! They're like, and now he's eating oatmeal. Target is in the bathroom over. I just, uh, every time I'm doing stuff, I just hear this this voice of self-doubt. You're not good enough. Nothing. Why did I jump? Why? Why? I did this so good the first time. Oh, my God. This is a, this is a tough one. 
Yeah, you did do a good job the first I time. Keep getting, what happened? I keep getting bumped by people. So that's what I just. Happened? That's I'm not talking to you. That's just the voice inside my head. Oh. That was a joke. I was doing a joke. Your first life was great. <laughs> you can't handle it now. How many midlife crises can one person have? Three. Three. Th what? That you got robbed. I'm done. I'm done. You got robbed, done. Oh, that guy. Remember he came to our stream once. Yeah, once, dunce. You got this. You got this. You got I this. I got this. I thought it was Dunzo. Dunzo Bunzo. Dunzo buckets. The uh, the color scheme is like the trans flag. Um, I was watching a Mortal Kombat tournament. And uh, really good player. His name's Sonic Fox. He's like really, really good. Um, they were listing the nationality flags for everybody who was playing in the tournament, and uh, he <laughs> decided to put the trans flag behind him. So it was like all these countries, and he had the trans flag behind nice. him. So that was pretty cool. The furry, exactly the furry. Sonic Fox rules. I have met that person in real life back when tournaments were um, a thing that we could do in in person. And he was in his full fursuit. Weird. It's what it's, it's what they do. All right, all right, all right. I can do this. I can so do this. Cool furnace up on blocks. Yeah, it's gotta be supported by something. Why not blocks? It's up real tall on those blocks. Well, I didn't install Small it. Small furnace? Yeah. Let's just be kind of small and then they were like, well, we don't want to extend these things down. Yep. Let's just put it on some blocks. Oh, this one. I can do this one. I can so do this. It's not weird if that's what you're into. It's not weird if that's what you're into. It's not weird if it's not what you're into. I agree. Monty fell asleep on me, and he is snoring. Aw, Monty. Mr. Montague! I haven't seen Monty in a long time, and he's a good dog. What? Dummy. I saw Monty like uh, pretty soon after y'all got him. Is that some kind of a brag? What? No, it's just been that long. What heck? <laughs> Another staff person kept using what don't the yuck, heck? yuck, I don't yuck their yum in a meeting, and I don't think they knew it was used in the king context. Don't yuck yeah. their yum. I so okay. Here's my condensed version of a longer story. Yuck their yum. I, I was like, oh, I have a better one that I like. Don't poop on someone's stoop, because I like the way that sounds. So don't poop on someone's stoop. Don't crush me. somebody's mush. Yeah. And uh, I told it to uh, Stacy. And I was like, oh, yeah. Like, just don't do that. Like, don't uh, yuck their yum is now don't poop on their stoop. And she's like, don't yuck their poop. I'm like, way gross. I was just, like, gagging. Disgusting. Wrong combination of words. Don't poop their butt. Don't poop their butt. <laughs> a Stacy classic. Nope. Let me on here. You got this. Oh, yeah. Get off of me. Except that stupid burb. Get off of me, burb. Oh, yeah. Crushing it. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. That's a good one. That's okay. My mom always says, like, she has a fetish for things. <laughs> Just because she like <laughs> enjoys them, yeah. she's like, I just I have a, means. I just have a fetish for cookies, and I'm like, oh, mom, you <laughs> oh, shouldn't say it. So like, we explain <laughs> it to her cookies? one day, and she still says it every once in a while. These cookies over here. <laughs> uh, similarly, my mom would say like, uh, instead of flip flops, she'd say thongs. She's like, oh yeah, oh, I thongs. Gotta, I gotta find my thongs. I'm like, please use the new interpretation of those <laughs> flip flops, please. Gotta put. I keep looking for my thongs, yeah. honey. Have you seen my thongs? I'm smelling what you're stepping in, scooping what you're pooping, mopping what you're putting down, <laughs> mopping what you're spilling. <laughs> mopping what you're stepping in. <laughs> scooping what you're pooping. I like that one. <laughs> my thong on the porch. I left my thongs out in the rain. Yeah, they got all wet. Got all ruined. So I left them on the porch? Got all wet and swelled up. Thongs got all wet. On the stoop. On the stoop. 
Stoop kids sitting on a stoop. Stoop kids afraid to leave a stoop. Dun, 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 dun. Jump through the holes to score points. I don't know. I don't understand this one. I hate when I leave my stoop. Yeah, just it's all super sandy. Uh, do you ever try to do the thing when you go to the beach where like you're, you're wearing uh, shoes or you don't have sandals or flip flops? Listen, or whatever? any beach is a nude beach if you try hard enough. That's true, but what it's like super about? hot and you're just like, no, I can take it. I can take Ooh, it. I, and then she's like, oh god, I can't this take is it. Ter- terrible idea. Terrible idea. Terrible yeah. idea. <laughs> See, I don't understand this one. Score Ooh, points. soup kids. Like what? Those are the best kids. You gotta go like, through the hole. I know. I tr- I tried, man. <laughs> I'm trying my best here. Okay, I went through that one. Did hole. take a slightly nudie pic at the beach. What? Somebody bumped me. Were you me. wearing just your uh, your Starbucks apron at the beach, of course? Why? I wish everyone would stop bumping me. Oh my god. So games like this, um, I've heard of them. Or there's this mechanic like the bumping. Like Mario Kart. Are you stuff. like the copper tone girl? I always feel like I am usually the bumpy. You, and I, you are the one getting bumped. And I can never you know I can the never be the bumper. And it drives me crazy when people bump me off course. Like that just Cause happened. Because you're, you're playing Mario Kart. Why well, I'm not playing Mario Kart. Well, I know, but it drives you crazy. Hilarious. <laughs> that's, why, that's why we do this. Oh my god. Jump through holes. That's what this says in the top left. I'm doing it. <laughs> just jump through the holes. Uh, it's just this one. It's so hard for me because I get bumped every five seconds. I'm so sorry. And then like I drives me off course. Drives me up a wall. It. You know what the pirate said about the wheel in his pants? You know what like grinds my gears? <laughs> he said it's driving me nuts. <laughs> yeah, it's driving his nuts around. <laughs> Is steering wheel on his nads. <laughs> that, yep. That's the joke. Gonads and strife. You guys, remember gonads and strife? Um, that internet video about squirrels and gonads. I don't remember that gonads actually. And strife. Ethan knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> I'm gonna say it again. Trout. This guy knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> All right, everyone. Thank you for coming to another. Another edition of Tim and Matt Play. That's right. Thank you for stopping by. <laughs> he does not either. I very much do not. <laughs> well, you know what? Just Google Gonads and Strife. And, you know, it's one of those classic, like, kind of like the llama song. Everyone knows the llama song, right? Llama, I, llama, here's a llama, 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 little llama, 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 duck. You know that one? I probably do. Yeah. That, that's been classic a Classic old yeah. internet stuff. Badger, badger. I definitely know badger. The llama song, Red 13. Or the Gonads and Strife. I definitely know Badger. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, see? Llama, 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 llama. It's great stuff. Ethan also knows Badger, but not the Llama song. Great All stuff. All right. So we got a smattering. We got, we got, yeah, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. But you know what we do have? Another one in the can. And we're going to see everybody <laughs> back here. Disgusting. <laughs> next time. On the next time. Bye. Fart. <laughs>